Help me, and I can free you of your immortality. Thank <laughs> you. 
It pleases me to see you recovered, old friend. Indeed, old friend. No! Relax. Our guest is just a little confused. I know what he wants. You see before you, the legendary vampire killer. Your old weapon, if you recall. The only weapon capable of ending your immortal life. You thought it destroyed. But you see, you can have the eternal rest you crave, after all. But first, you must help me. Prevent Satan's return to the world. Then, I swear to you, I will deliver the fatal blow to your heart myself. And I am sure you will fulfill that vow. Since you sent Satan back to hell a thousand years ago, his human offspring, or acolytes as they call themselves, have been dormant. I suppose that they, that all of us, feared your wrath and great power. But not now. Now, even my bodyguard is more than a match for you. The Acolytes know you are weak, and are preparing for their father's return. Now they fear nothing. Don't they fear the mighty Zobet? Only you, in full possession of your powers, can defeat them. Follow me, please. We must find and destroy the Acolytes before they can finalize their preparations for Satan's return. It won't be easy. They govern the world of men from the shadows. Not even I know with any degree of certainty who or where they are. They won't come out into the light unless we can force their hand. The Acolytes must never know who hunts them down. The element of surprise will give us the advantage. Until you are at full strength again. And you don't know who they are or where they are? Did you know that this city is built upon the foundations of your castle? The Acolytes are focusing their attentions here for very good reason. Satan has specifically chosen this place for his return. He means to enslave you first, to humiliate you for what you did to him. Let's get on with it. 